Yep, back it up. Right this way. He's got like a spoiler on the back. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. More. Oh, oh, forward now. You gotta go forward. Too much. And go. Oh, there. There you go. Another beautiful Minnesota day. The remaining four snowmobiles that we ordered just came in, so we're gonna go pick those up. This beautiful blizzard came in just in time, but we are in a slight bit of a race against the clock because we have to get there and back before the roads get any worse. Yeah, and it's, it's getting pretty bad. I think you're already not supposed to be on the roads, but we have important business to get to today. It's coming down out there, bro. Yeah, it is. Finishing up on the posters? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, it's a lot more time consuming than I thought it would be. So we did some signed posters in the last merch drop on cboystv.com. All those posters are gone, but we still do have some stuff left. If you missed it, head on over there. We appreciate all you guys who got something last week. I think we might be in a pickle, Rick. I don't think we can fit four crated sleds into that trailer. Well, I don't know what else to do. Load them on top of the limo? I don't know if that would work. What do you think? Like, I think the roof is going to cave in. Oh, you think so? Yeah. We've done it with pit bikes. I'm pretty sure the limo's only rear wheel drive too. Mmm. Might be a safety hazard on the road. <laughs> yeah. You're going to make me sweat back here. Well, I'm sweating up here, dude. All right, we made it. Do you want to run in there, Mike? Howdy. We are here to pick up some snowmobiles. Uh, we just got a call and they said there's four of them in. We got another one here home today. Oh, Shoot. five. I called them this morning and they said, yeah, we got four. And then a fifth one just came today. So. Oh, seriously? We got the whole fleet. Oh, uh, who ordered orange? We should tell Ken's his didn't come in. You think he'd care? He, yeah, that's true. He gets negative presence this video. Another eight fitty. Man, I'm so horny for some feeling. Me to too. Do you grab any straps? Oh, you grab the straps. Oh. No one's ever seen anyone in most snowmobiles this stupid. Push, Mike. Come on, Mike. Come on, Mike. Do you think I just like free out the rest of your energy? <laughs> Is this DOT approved? It's fine. We somehow have managed to amaze even myself every time we do something. Right fast, take chances. So I started taking it real easy. <laughs> Good news, Ken, your snowmobile's here. And I didn't even wreck it. Yay. That's no way to be excited about something. I don't even think he is excited. It's gonna be another shitty surprise, I already know it. <laughs> <laughs> Give me some shitty surprise. Ken, I'm such a narcissist. You on Polaris like that, Ken. What do you think we're about to pull out of the trailer? I don't know. I wasn't expecting a, a lazy boy to be turned into a toilet, so I. The bar is pretty low. But you love that one. No. You used it all weekend, Ken. When? No, all week, every single time you had to go to the bathroom. No. Hey, let's go, man. Good, are you doing? Pretty good. See, you're just gonna stand there. I'm filming. Will you do something over here, dude? Sorry, Come sorry. on, do something productive. <laughs> Just gonna stand there. All right, shall we do this? Okay. All right, Ken. Don't unwrap your surprise, buddy. This isn't a shitty surprise now, is it? No, this is a great surprise. Yeah. I picked my colors first and CJ called me in the middle of the night. Is it okay if I get the same colors as you? We gotta figure out who's or who's, who got what. Honestly, I don't really remember. I think mine's all black. The 146 cam. 
It's like Christmas morning every time. Oh, sick. All right, boys, this is pretty sick. We got them all together. It looks like a dealership in here. We got mine, Chaos 155, and then we've got the Slash back here. So basically, the tunnel's shorter than the skid. Better for wheelies, turnouts. Basically, the snowmobile is ready to do anything. The talent is not. So, hopefully that helps the talent. Ken, Assault 146, same slide we got last year. Such a good snowmobile, wheelie machine. And then this is the one we've had for like two months now. CJ's VR1 850, great sled. More of like a trail sled though. This is kind of like crossover. crossover works on trail, works for ditches. Overall great sled. And then, let's see, Ryan, same sled as me. Uh, 155 slash, right? Yeah. Yeah. I got cooler colors, and the only difference is that I have this screen. That is pretty badass. You've got like a full on iPad up here. Mm -hmm. Look at that, zero miles. That's fresh. Yeah. And then this is kind of like the community sled. It's a 146 slash. So it's like the shorter versions of me and Ryan's, um, but still the slash. I think this is actually going to wheelie over backwards. I named it the weapon. It's going to be a weapon. The weapon. So my sled's like comically underpowered compared to all these. It's a race sled It's though. a race sled, so they had to put the 600 in it. I just got it wrapped. So that's the sled fleet. We got all of them now. Plus Mike's from last year. Yeah. This sled's still probably the most badass one here. Yo guys, I'd like to give a big thanks to today's sponsor, NordVPN. As you guys can probably guess, we spend a lot of time on the internet. And some of that stuff that we put on the internet as creators, we'd like to keep personal. So we use NordVPN to keep us and our personal devices safe from anyone trying to access that information. NordVPN is super easy to use. Connect with one click or enable auto connect for zero click protection. They have over 5,200 servers in 60 countries, allowing you to change the location of your network so that you can access content that you would not normally get at home. For example, I used it to watch a show in Canada that was not available in the US. It's super easy, just open the map, click on the location, and you'll be connected in seconds. It supports up to six devices on one account on all major operating platforms. And my favorite part, no more bandwidth throttling. So, what that means is you're internet service provider might slow down your internet based on your usage. NordVPN will now encrypt that traffic so that your internet service provider can't see that and won't slow down your internet speeds. So head over to nordvpn.com slash cboystv to get a two-year plan plus one additional month with a huge discount. It's risk-free with Nord's 30-day money-back guarantee. That's nordvpn.com slash cboystv. Now back to the video. I think all the roads around us are closed. It's pretty much a whiteout and uh I think it's 10 below right now, which is gonna suck. I'm taking the Chaos 146. CJ's on his VR1. Taking Ken's assault. He's not here, so. Ken's doing taxes right now, so. And then Mike's taking his snow bike, I think. Oh, 
one of the best posts right there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so cold outside it's blowing like crazy but honestly this is a pretty good time that's the love hate of riding in a blizzard you can't see it's usually cold it's windy but it's good snow the feels like is negative 32. holy crap oh, you guys have gopros working not anymore but it was for a while mine finally quit yeah. mine isn't working anymore either some of the biggest been, I think. they always look scary but then once you hit them once then they don't they aren't that bad Worst part about Minnesota drifts is when you land, there's no snow at the bottom. He's still going. He spreads on the snow bike. He snow bike Mike. Snow bike Mike. Feels like negative 30. The drifts are insane. The rest of the snow is like an ice skating rink. And now we're at TJ's Booze and Bistro, Lake Eunice, Minnesota. This is what I needed, boys. I had to turn back around and double check, make sure my key was still in the ignition. We spent like 15 minutes digging for my key because it fell out. And then when it was sitting on top of the snow, Ryan ran it over. All right, guys, a little wrap up from yesterday. It was uh, insanely cold, but the snow was actually pretty good. Still had a blast, dude. That was super fun. The chaos was sick. The salt, I think, was the winner of the day. We met Ken to eat last night at TJ's, and he was pretty sad that he didn't get to put the first miles on. Well, they put on 38 miles. Hard, hard, hard miles, 38 though. miles. Dude, it ripped. These poor things, man. They oh. have not been broken in properly. <laughs> All right, so we're going ice fishing with our buddy Fix. It's like a little village out here. Yeah, there's gotta be like 50 ice houses out here. So there's a lot of fish down, this is a good spot. Great spot. Okay, cool. Since we're actually gonna be catching fish today, not just beers, we need to make like a little challenge or a bet, I say on it. So I was thinking, the last person to catch a fish, we cut a hole in the ice and then you have to jump in. All right, I just hope it's not me, man. Good. Let the fishing commence. Yes! No. Yes! No. Yes! Oh! 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 Oh!
Jay's definitely got one. It's a pig, dude. It's a pig. Ah, I'm not going in the lake. Let's go. Oh, thank God. Should we go cut the hole tonight, guys? <laughs> Good God. Ah, yeah. oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. Uh, all right, how the fuck do you get it off of here? Legitimately, this is the first fish I've ever caught in my life. What? Got it right there. They're so slippery. God, this is gross. They're fucking. They're gr <laughs> <laughs> well, boys, I think that's all she wrote. I can see the disappointment in his face. Where? Where can you see the disappointment? All right, boys, the day has come. So as you guys know, Ryan and Micah lost the fishing challenge yesterday. So we're trudging out to the lake right now for them to go for a little dip. Hey, thanks for doing this, man. I really appreciate it. I know Ryan does, too. I think he does. He looks really plump. Ryan, we're thinking about just going out in the middle. That's perfect, we should. The farther I have to run, the more likely chance that I'll die. That'd be good, because I updated my life insurance policy. This, this is drops off it's too far. This I don't nice care. and deep. I need it to be this deep. I don't yeah. need it to be 14 well, feet you, deep. You want your head to go under, don't you? It will go under, I promise well, you. You need to have it so it's deep enough where the Remember ice isn't frozen to the ground. You're making this guy Here, dig his own grave, too. Mike, you need to start wearing a hat like that all the time. This isn't a hat. Or well, whatever the f your little mask. I think you look like a hippie or like a hitchhiker. I don't really want to look like a hitchhiker, so I'm not going to take no, your advice. You look like a hitchhiker, dude. Yeah, I just said I don't want to look like a hitchhiker, so I'm not going to take your advice. You don't need to take my advice. You already look like one. You can tell Mike doesn't want to do this because he's actually pissed off right now. When do you see Mike pissed off? Pissed You're off, really Mike. I'm more pissed at you guys being f***ing clowns than having to do this. What do you, how am I being a clown? He's ticked off. He is. Apparently we're being clowns. I'm like, dude, you're just holding up your end of the deal. Right, just think of it like an ice bath. And people do ice baths all the time. Ken, have you ever taken an ice bath? Fuck no. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> hey, try to run across it. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Oh. Go away! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Dad just dropped the stick! Oh, it got sucks under it. What, did a Loch Ness Monster grab it from you? There you go. Get it? Gotta get it! We're going! Sorry, Mike. I cannot I'm believe you guys literally. are doing this. I right. can't believe it either, dude. Why are we doing this? <laughs> oh, God. I can't even think straight right now. <laughs> 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 okay. My boots are on the wrong feet. Ryan, my favorite part about you jumping in was this savage move of leaving one sock on, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cold right now, my skin feels hot. Ah, oh, it hurts, dude. CJ's got dry, frozen drool on his face. Yeah, yeah. I was laughing so damn hard. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's it. If you're not subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. Go to cboystv.com, get some gear, and uh, we will see you guys on whenever we see you. Yeah. And listen to the podcast I have to go edit yeah. after this. Yeah, go check out the podcast, Life Wide Open Podcast with C-Boy C-Boy.